Secretary West in the Ministry of External Affairs has summoned the Irish Ambassador, Mr. Philly McLaughlin, today. During his meeting with the Irish Ambassador, the Secretary West expressed India's concern and angst in Indian society about the untimely and tragic death of Savita Halapanavar. He said, we are unhappy that a young life had to come to an untimely end. He expressed the hope that the inquiry that has been instituted will be independent and that our ambassador in Dublin will be provided with information regarding its progress and outcome. The Irish ambassador has given assurance that it was their desire to provide the fullest cooperation with the Irish side on the follow-up inquiries into the circumstances of the death of Savita Halapanavar. He also indicated that the terms of reference for the inquiry are being framed and would be released shortly. Maha Siddiqui uh, gets us more details. Maha, uh, assurance coming in from the Irish ambassador that access will be provided for the Indian ambassador there to the investigation and all the processes that ensue now. Yes, absolutely, Shiv. The major concern of the Indian side uh, since morning after the Irish side put out a statement saying that uh, the second inquiry, which was meant to be partly public, remember yeah. the first one was an internal inquiry of the hospital, which uh, would not go public, but the second inquiry, which was being uh, conducted by the health ministry in Ireland, would be public. But the terms and conditions were not clear. That is the reason why the Ministry of External Affairs was keen to speak to the ambassador to know whether there would be an independent external expert on yeah. that panel probing or will he be just overseeing the report. So those are the clarifications coming forth now. And clearly it is only after those inquiry reports are accessible to India that India can go forward on the case.